When you think of actors doing stunts, you probably think of Jackie Chan or Buster Keaton or Tom Cruise. But the most underrated stunt performed by an actor was done by none other than Gene Wilder. So let's talk a little about Willy Wonka. Here's Gene in 2013 explaining Willy Wonka's legendary entrance to Robert Osborne. The director, Mel Stewart, mm -hmm. he said, what do you think? Because he gave me the script. I said, it's very good, but there's something missing. And if I play that part, I want to come out with a cane and that something's wrong with my leg and come down the stairs slowly and then have the cane stick into one of the bricks that are down there. Get up, start to fall over, then roll around and then, and then they all laugh and they applaud and uh, what do you want to do that for? <laughs> Here's the director of Willy Wonka, Mel Stewart, in a 2005 interview with Mark Gordon. We shot this in Munich, Germany. We had two stuntmen work with him to make him fall forward. Just try it yourself one day. Stand up and try and fall forward, and you'll understand how difficult something like that is. And it worked beautifully. He's right. It's really hard. Look how parallel Gene Wilder gets to the ground. He's at about a 45-degree angle before he even starts to talk. He looks like Michael Jackson dancing to Smooth Criminal. The most underrated part of this is the acting that happens in addition to the stunt. Willy Wonka's cane gets stuck in the ground, Gene feels for the cane that's no longer there, then he falls forward, gracefully tumbles, then pops up to a raucous ovation. It's certainly not as easy as it looks, nor as safe as it looks, but here Gene is with a perfectly fluid, well-executed somersault. A somersault that hits the mark, and that's why it's underrated. Thanks for watching. Thank you.